Hi, it's Steve. Today we'd like to show you how to change a hinge kit on your dishwasher. It's a really easy job. Let me show you how we do it. Now to do this repair, we will need to pull the dishwasher part way out of the cabinets. So the first thing we need to do is to disconnect the electrical supply. So locate the electrical panel, turn off the appropriate breaker or remove the appropriate fuse. Then verify that we have enough slack in both our drain hose and fill hose and the electrical line to allow us to pull that dishwasher approximately six to eight inches out of the cabinets. Detach the screws that secure the tabs to the bottom of your countertop and then pull the dishwasher in. Now with the dishwasher pulled slightly out of the cabinets, our next step will be to open the door up and remove two lower screws that secure the front panel to the inner door panel. You need to support the outer door panel against the inner door panel until we tilt it into an upright position. Then let it lower down, tilt it out, and lift it away from the dishwasher. We'll set that aside. Now with the dishwasher pulled out of the cabinets far enough that we can access the hinge link, we're going to begin by disconnecting that. So simply stretch the spring and lift that link off of the bottom of the hinge. And next we'll remove the two screws that secure the hinge to the door. Use a 3 8 wrench on the nut that the screw fits into to loosen it. And then remove the screws. They're typically a number 25 Torx head screw. Now next we'll remove the screw that acts as a hinge pin. It threads into this aluminum rod across the front, so use a pair of pliers and just grasp that rod to keep it from turning and then loosen the screw. Remove the screw, set that aside, remove the old hinge and discard it. Now just verify that we have the proper hinge, they're marked both left and right. So we'll begin by laying the new hinge alongside the door, install one of the new screws that was supplied with the kit, and secure it with one of the nuts that came with that kit as well. Second screw in. And now we'll tighten those in place using our 3 8 wrench and our number 25 Torx driver. Tighten them both securely. And next we'll install that shoulder bolt that acts as a hinge pin. So we'll need to line that up with that aluminum rod. Thread it into place. Now what we need to make sure is that that shoulder on that bolt fits into the opening on that hinge. So you may need to lift the door up slightly to line that up. Use your pliers to keep that rod from turning and tighten it securely. Well, next we're ready to reattach that spring and take note that there is a one long slot on that link and that should face down and lift it into place on the hook and now we're ready to do the opposite side. So we'll begin by lifting that link off of the door hinge. Just lay that down. 
back in, we'll remove the two screws that secure the hinge to the inner door. Then next, the hinge pin or hinge bolt. Once we remove that, discard the old hinge. Next, we'll take our new hinge, line it up on the door, install one of the new bolts. it with the new nuts line up the bottom one and secure it as well and tighten them using the wrench and now we're ready to put that shoulder bolt in and again make sure that the shoulder of that hinge bolt fits into the inset of the new hinge up on the door to line that up properly and tighten that screw securely. We'll reconnect the hinge link and now we're ready to line the dishwasher back up in the opening and install the front panel. Now when installing that front panel we want to make sure that we line up these four slotted openings with the tabs that protrude from that inner door panel. laying flush against the inner door panel and just lift up on it. It should tuck up underneath the edge of the control panel. Open that door fully. You may need to support that panel together and then we'll reinstall the screws. Now once we've secured both of those bottom screws, we can close the dishwasher up and push it back into the cabinet. Now that we have the dishwasher pushed back into the cabinets, we can secure it to the bottom of the countertop, reconnect the power, and our repair is complete.